Hello, welcome to Daily Wellness. My name is Emily. I'm doing my medical residency and living a life of harmony and balance, or at least trying to. So thank you for joining me in the effort. I'm gonna go ahead and get started lying on my back, hugging my knees into my chest. I'm gonna gently give myself a back massage Rolling the base of my spine, my lower back, middle back, upper back, just side to side, maybe back and forth. Maybe squeeze one knee into my chest and then the other. And I'm going to alternate squeezing right knee into chest as I kick left leg out long. And then hug left knee towards left armpit as right leg is kicked out long. And then I'm going to bring my knees over my hips and grab my knees with both hands. Take a deep breath in and as I exhale, I'm going to hug my knees in towards my heart. Inhale, I'm going to return knees over hips, arms are long. And exhale, I'm hugging knees into chest. You can continue at your own pace. Bringing your knees over your hips with each inhale and with each exhale, hugging your knees into your heart. You can maybe even squeeze opposite elbows and give yourself a little back side to side if you want to pause in between inhales and exhales. Inhaling, I bring my knees over my hips. Exhale, I squeeze my knees into my heart and rock side to side. Inhale, knees over hips, and exhale. I'm grabbing opposite elbows around my knees and really getting in there. And then I'm going to plant both feet on the ground. Knees are pointing towards the sky. I'm going to take my hands and just start creating more space, pulling my head out uh, further away from my shoulder blades. I can really um, use my fingers and my thumb to run along the back of my neck and the base of my skull and just create a little more space. Maybe even give myself a little scalp massage here. Waking up all those hair follicles. And then I'm gonna massage the space just below each ear, taking turns. using my thumb to massage my right jaw and left thumb to massage left jaw. And I just wanna um, take my right fingertips and gently massage the area under my right eye and above my right eye. And then taking left fingertips, I'm gonna massage the area under my left eye. And then massage the area above my left eye. And grabbing knees with both hands once again, or maybe grabbing behind my knees, I'm going to rock back and forth a couple times. And eventually I'm going to rock up to a seated position. I can really have fun getting there. And eventually come to a comfortable seat. I'm just going to pause here, notice what I feel, see what I can release or relax. I'm going to flutter my lips, inhaling deeply and exhaling with a <laughs> And inhaling, I'm going to interlace my hands, look up, reach up, press my palms into the sky, and exhale. Reach my palms and top of my head towards the earth, rounding the back. Inhale, everything up, looking up, pressing palms into the sky. And exhale, rounding down, pressing palms, crown of head towards the earth. 
And one more time to really make the most of it. Reaching up, looking up, squeezing shoulders together, elongating through my whole spine. And exhale. Pressing palms towards the earth. I'm going to release my fingers and plant my right hand on the ground beside me. Inhale, left fingertips up. And as I exhale, I'm going to slide over, coming to rest on right forearm as my, um, my left arm reaches over my head. Neck can be neutral. Left hand parallel with the earth. Creating space for my head between my arms and my shoulders. One more inhalation here, and as I exhale, I'm gonna come through to center, planting left palm on the earth beside me, and inhaling right fingertips up. I'm eventually gonna tip over, feeling one long line of energy from right hip through right pinky finger, coming to rest on left forearm. Heart is shining upwards, neck neutral, being mindful of the space, the shapes created by my body, the feeling of my breath, moving in and out. And then rolling through again, I'm going to come into a low squat here with palms pressed together, my heart center, and elbows pressing into knees. Feet are pointed outwards and wider than my hips. I'm going to take a moment here to just see what I notice. See what physical sensations arise to my attention and see where my mind goes. I'm going to inhale, elongating from my tail through the crown of my head and exhale I'm gonna press my palms into the earth walk my feet about hips width distance apart or two fists and let everything hang heavy in a simple forward fold I can bend my knees a lot or a little feel my neck go really relaxed let the weight of my head pull my neck down I'm gonna shake my head yes shake it no can help create more space, pushing my vertebra by interlacing my fingers and placing my palms on the nape of my neck, and letting the weight of my elbows pull my head a little bit further down. And then I'm going to inhale up to a flat back, bringing palms to shins or tops of thighs. And exhale, let everything go. Interlacing fingers and letting hands fall heavy over my head. You can inhale and exhale with a sigh. And then letting your hands go, we're gonna, I'm gonna um, sit my hips low. I reach my hands high, coming into a little chair pose here. Feeling the warmth in my thighs, in my belly as I bring my navel towards my spine and gently tuck my tail. Seeing if I can um, peek and see my, my toes over my knees and maybe sit back a little further. I can lift up all 10 toes and then root them back down into the earth. And reach up, look up, like I'm reaching towards something that I really want. What could it be? What do I want? <laughs> I think I just want this right now. One more breath here. As we stand up, bring palms together, look up, arching the spine gently, and exhale. I'm gonna bring palms to heart center. And from here, I'm going to pour all my weight into my left leg as 
is I bring my right leg up and over so that right knee is over left and right foot wraps around left calf. And coming into cactus arms, I'm going to wrap right arm under left so that palms are together. I can lift my elbows up here, feeling the space created between my shoulder blades. Inhale to lengthen, and as I exhale, I'm going to gently bend my knees and sit low again. And breathe here. You can help to focus on one point. And I feel the breath moving in and out of my body. And then unraveling, I'm going to kick my right leg out long behind me as I come to reach my right fingertips towards the sky and left fingertips towards the earth. Right toes, right fingers, all very active. And I'm working towards shining my heart more and more to the right. And using the energy coming from the right half of my body to really lift, lift myself up here. And then returning both hands to the ground, I'm going to kick my right leg up high. And then float it back down to the earth. And let everything go in a forward fold. And inhaling, I'm going to gently roll up, knees slightly bent. And then I'm going to let go of something that I no longer need, that is no longer serving me, particularly these really warm, fuzzy socks. I'm very fortunate to have them, but I don't need them right now. And then I'm going to come to stand again in mountain pose. So my big toes, my heels are touching, palms shine forward as my tailbone tucks, navel comes in towards my spine. Fingers actively reaching to the earth and shoulders roll down the back, head floats up. And I'm going to pour my weight into my right foot. Once I feel very steady there, I'm going to wrap my left leg around my right. And then wrap left elbow around right. So that palms are together again as I sink low, bending knees. Reaching my hips low, but my hands high here. Squeezing palms and knees together. Leaving space to breathe. It may help to focus on one point. And then inhaling to stand, I'm gonna unwrap everything, kick my left leg out strong. And it's hard to do this with a lot of hair, but I'm gonna reach left fingertips to the sky, shining my left heart forward. And as happens, especially on camera, especially when I'm being watched, <laughs> you may find yourself unsteady, but you can always meet yourself with compassion. One more breath here, and then I'm going to bring both um, hands to the earth and kick my left foot up high. Neck hangs heavy. And then I'm going to float left foot down to the earth to meet right. And then come up to stand, and then shake it all out, shaking out wrists, right foot, left foot, everything. And once I'm all shook out, I'm going to return to a comfortable seat, return to my breath, return to this moment. and see what, what floats to the surface, what I notice. And I 
invite you to join me on a, a simple meditation of remembering a time that you felt maybe stressed out today and just see if you can recreate what that felt like physically in your body. Maybe there's a tightness somewhere. Maybe there's a sensation of your heart racing. And by, <laughs> by bringing awareness to our physical response to stress, it can, um, yoga can help us become more aware of our bodies. And then when we have that, that emotional reaction, we can um, use our skills of awareness to free the openness into tight spaces and when we are physically more stressed than is helpful to us because uh, we need to go about our day. We can then help our, um, bring ourselves back to a place of calm and productivity. And so if you want to visualize a time that you were stressed that you can remember and what that felt like physically. And then just breathe into that sensation and see if you can maybe ease it just a little bit, just enough to bring it down a notch. And and may this practice serve you well in the event that you are stressed in the future. That you'll be able to separate that, that emotional factor from the physical component. And may this connection between breath and body and mind and emotion always feel available to you. And it's, it's natural if it doesn't always feel available. That's life. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just off screen. There's a really funny situation going on with a cat in a box. <laughs> um, so may you find humor, if only in retrospect. <laughs> and warriors, I wish you much success on your journey to a more calm and well life. Namaste.